These moronic Masonic parasites have no power over me anymore. They are harassing me and try to manipulate me while I'm asleep, using their dream management software. Long story short, approximately five years ago I've sold my three-bedroom apartment and went to Singapore and Hong Kong to open few businesses. I was a targeted individual back then but I didn't know exactly what gangs talking is and what they are doing. Basically, they sabotaged me, stole all my ideas and business plans and tried to kill me if I have known back then, I wouldn't have sold my apartment. Now, five years later they are rubbing it in my face via the internet and Facebook ads. They are watching the targeted individuals 24-7, the stalking, harassment, and bullying are 24-7-365. They have decided to remind me what they did to me when I've commented on one post in a targeted individuals group about a T who supposedly stabbed a taxi driver in Hong Kong. They can't have any influence on me anymore, so they keep reminding me what they did to me in the past. This video will be a short explanation of how they stalk, bully and harass targeted individuals using dream management software combined with cyber stalking and harassment. This is how they're rubbing it in your face. This is what they stole from me. 1. A blueprint for a free energy generator. They hired every single person that I tried to hire to work for me. 2. Aquaponics business plans. 3. Vertical farming business plans. 4. Permaculture design drawings and resources. 5. Organic cleaning products recipes. 6. Healthy eating recipes and fresh juice recipes enough to open a restaurant. 7. They have opened a healthy eating street food stall in Aarhus, Denmark, with my recipes, in the exact spot where I was planning to. 8. Travel website. 9. Over 40,000 ebooks. 10. Agro-tourism plans and ideas. 11. Water desalination plant business plan. 12. Vertical Co2 City Pollution Filter 13 and countless other ideas and business plans Long story short At first, they stole from me and tried to kill me After a few failed murder attempts on my life, they offered me money to join them Before they offered me money to join them, they told everyone that I was trying to kill them That I was sleeping with their wife backslash s That I was gay That I owned them money that I stole from them etc. If all of what they were saying about me was true, they wouldn't backslash t have offered me money to join them I guess that nobody wants a bad person in their group. They ruined my life because I refused to collaborate with them, and I was exposing all of their wrongdoings. The next short screen recording is my conversation with another TI, on the post about the TI in Hong Kong. Dream manipulation, pause the video and read the next text. In my dream or their dream aka induced dream, one of them mocked me because I have sold my apartment and at the moment I don't own a house. The morning after they have manipulated my dreams, I've made the following post. Apparently, I have managed to piss them off with my honesty about them. And then, boom, they have started cyberbullying, harassment, and they bombarded me with ads about properties, remortgage, refinance, loans, and other financial ads. This is the best part. 
Coincidence, you might say, yes, maybe, but. I'll explain why isn't a coincidence, those ads were on, on a Saturday night and were on only for a few hours, to add to that, there were all at the same time, or in a matter of few minutes apart, what company keeps their ads on only for a few hours, most genuine ads are up and running for days, this kind of harassment happened to me before, many times, this time I have decided to make a video about it and explain it. To everyone, every single targeted individual can confirm that this type of harassment happened to them too. Of course, I'm just paranoid schizophrenic, oh wait, I am not, 8 out of 10 ads on Facebook are about loans and properties, and on top of that, I even receive private messages on Facebook Messenger with loan offers to pay off my mortgage. Like share and subscribe to keep in touch. Video made by Gangstalking Attention Awareness.